Hey guys, Mel here, and today I am going to open the Arteza Holiday Advent Calendar, the 12-day Diane Hill um, collab, and this actually just sold out, I guess, over the weekend, because um, I got it last, I bought it, like, Friday, um, either thir no, Thursday, I think, um, I bought it Thursday. And so I just got it today, um, but anyway, we are going to open this and then maybe make some art with some of the supplies. So this one, it does say the contents that you get, but it doesn't say like what colors or what, um, where you're going to find them, but it also says meet Diane Hill. Uh, and you can find her at Instagram at Diane Hill Design. And Diane Hill is a classically trained London based artist bringing a modern take to an antique art style called Chinoiserie. <laughs> I don't know how to pronounce it. Um, C H I N O I S E R I E. Um, she, plant, she paints on silk, and the finished results are very delicate in palette, layout, and tone. Her paintings have a sense of depth with ultra-fine details. Her primary medium is gouache. Arteza is thrilled to partner with Diane for the special edition of our 2022 12-day holiday calendar. So, if I cover that part up, there's like a photo. So, let's get started opening this. To reveal the beautiful artwork on the front, and it says Happy Holidays Arteza 2022, and then on the back is where you open everything. I actually like this better than the last year with the 24 day calendar that I got um, last year. Like you had that really nice artwork that you had to open the doors on that. And obviously not to say that this isn't pretty, but it's nice that this is separate. So afterwards, you know, if you wanted to maybe cut this part out, you could save this part to make like a little wall hanging decoration or something. So let's get started opening the days. So we start with day number one, which is a big circle. And this one has, and in these you also either get a gold ticket or a silver ticket. Um, if you get gold, you can win a year of art supplies at $1,200 value. And if you have a silver ticket, you get an offer. I got a silver ticket. <laughs> and oh, look, this lovely silica type of um, sachets or a drying packet. This one doesn't really say silica, but it's a drying packet. So, you know. So first up, we have these two little wood slices. One and um, two wood slices and some string so that we can make ornaments. The wood slices do have holes on them so that you can string it through so that's you know very helpful you don't have to like drill in or glue it or anything um, and then day two wherever that one is down here oh this doesn't want to say anything oh so i should say read day one first <laughs> day one is shaped wood slices times two ornament Deck the halls with your new tree ornaments. Try painting, drawing, or even etching fantastic designs on these. Here we get three paint brushes, and they are, and it says day two, paint brushes times three. We have a round number four, a flat number six, and an angled number five. The perfect pairing for your next painting project, maybe even your wooden ornament. 
so got these very very nice paint brushes are always you know very helpful you can never really have too many day on to day number three we have some pine green acrylic paint day three acrylic paint tube pine green woohoo the first paint tube of the season let's get painting there we go to number four this one is christmas red acrylic paint so another paint tube they look they both look very nice here they are together definitely very traditional Christmassy. day four um, now we're painting with fire a dash of red to add some pizzazz we will go to five <laughs> snowman white acrylic paint so we've got now green red and white this is a great tool for highlighting making pastels and more yes white is definitely a color that every artist needs and then now on to day six and now we have blue blessings acrylic paint so a nice like a navy blue color nice deep blue so day six is no need to be blue mix it up for new shades like purple or teal day seven we're halfway oh it. <laughs> there we go. We get an acrylic marker in Sleigh Bell Silver. And it's an extra fine tip. And it says, did you know this works beautifully on wood, paper, glass, and more? And then from there we go to eight, which is this nice big box square over here. And here we have the little Arteza acrylic pad, which is 16 sheets, four inches by four inches, white, acid-free, heavyweight, glue bound, ideal for acrylics and oil painting. So it's this cute little pad of paper. Yes. The A ASM, ASMR of you know, the pad of paper being shuffled. Um, so it is 246 pound, 300 gram. So this would be very, very nice to try. And I love that this is small because one thing I do is I collect dolls. <laughs> so I love like tiny art, um, and this could even, you know, I could even make this tinier, but I love tiny art because it's just like perfectly doll sized. So that is, you know, I just love it. Um, dual purpose for me. So it says uh, for today, for day eight, pro tip, all media are fair game on a mixed media pad. So now we are at day nine and here we have another acrylic paint in holiday gold. So day nine says, all that shines is glittering gold. Add some highlights to your art. And then we've got 10. 10 is a green paint marker in mistletoe green. So this is a lighter green compared to our darker green paint. So this one says, dabbling in mixed media, this pairs perfectly with paint and pencils. And the second to last one, day 11, and here we get red ribbon, which is acrylic marker. So again, it's lighter than our Christmas red. So that's always nice that you can have like a darker version, darker shade and a lighter shade. Add some details to your painting. And then last but not least is our last art supply that we get. Day 12. So this 
some beautiful holographic glitter and it's got like small pieces it's got larger pieces it looks like it has stars in it like it's a starry glitter like oh so beautiful it's kind of coming out more um, silver but you can kind of see the the other colors shiny glitter jar silver this doesn't have to be the end shop the collection so these are all the items that come in this 12 day calendar and again here's the back with everything open but you still have this beautiful artwork so it's still you can like stick it on your mantle you can kind of cut it out to you know put on a wall or even you could probably even just leave it like this um because you can like hook it up to like something from there um, and just like you know have some nice little wall decor so that's always like really nice and even some of these since I'm a crafty person like if I take this off and get rid of the color or even add a sticker or something I could like you know kind of cut this down and like use that for some sort of crafting thing if I wanted to um, along with the ribbon like each thing has a thing of ribbon that you can like you know cut off and if you need a little stripper ribbon there you go you can use it <laughs> um, or there's foam in here so different things that you can actually use to um, for your crafting needs if it's not just art you can use it for other kinds of crafts um, you know waste not want not so we are going to maybe make a little bit of art and yeah so let's get started Thank you. 
Here is the painting that I made. I made a little snowman at night with the moon shining down and the snowman is holding a little sleigh bell since the silver marker is sleigh bell silver. <laughs> I decided to, you know, put that in. And so let me know in the comments what you think. I think he's adorable. I tried to work with doing shadows a bit, which I need to practice more and even though the sky came out a little more glittery than I liked I do love glitter um, even if it's not the most environmentally conscious uh, craft item out there I do love it it's so sparkly um, so yeah let me know in the comments what you think also if you like this video please like press the like button and subscribe for more videos and also please leave comments did you get any of either any of the advent calendars from Arteza this year um there was the 12 day one there were and there were two um 24 day ones so did you get any of them and what are your favorite supplies from Arteza if you've used them or if you haven't used them what would you know what are you interested in um note this video is not sponsored but anyway let me know in the comments so i will see you in the next video bye <laughs>